Well, a beloved Poland restaurant is working hard to reopen by the end of the year after damage from a fire. WAOB News 10's Tristan Clements was at Ed's truck, truck stop today to learn why that restaurant is so important to the Worth County community. Poland is a Georgia small town encompassing about 800 residents. The small town hosts farmers, east and westbound travelers, and truck drivers making the rounds on Highway 82. All being from various backgrounds, lives, and cultures, they share one thing in common when traveling in Worth County. Ed's Truck Stop a place of friendship, fellowship, and where all are welcome to a southern kitchen. On Friday nights or Sundays around lunch, you'll be hard pressed to find a spot to park at this parking lot, Ed's Truck Stop in Poland. Now that's something that hasn't been the case since the restaurant caught fire earlier this year. It destroyed everything. We was in the middle of lunch and just got to smelling something burning and we went out back and the back of the restaurant where the meat department was at, it was on fire. Patrons were forced out during a Sunday lunch rush on March 24th, 2024. Since then, several community members raised money to help get the restaurant back on its feet. Owner Gail Lee helped return the favor with a food truck offering meals until they could fully reopen. We started the food truck. Um, we deal with the senior citizens daily, and we just, you know, we wanted them to be able to come back out and get, you know, what they were used to. Regulars told me they can't wait until the main restaurant reopens, giving them a community center that many grew up with. Edmund Souter, also known as Ed, founded this restaurant 60 years ago in 1964. Over those decades, he's been seen by those in the community as a role model for being a good Christian man. He was always somebody that, um, as a young man, that I looked up to. When, when the fire happened, I, I drove by and I would, I would look at it and I would say, God, uh, you know, I pray that you bless him. And, um, and, um, and I had in my mind, you know, what, what it could be like. And then, then Eddie called me and, uh, and I said, well, I've been waiting on you to call me, Eddie. I, 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 got, I, I feel like I got a plan for you. The contractor working to rebuild the restaurant hopes to give the regulars like himself a new dining experience similar to the atmosphere they already know and love. This used to be a full wall right here with a going to be some of the old mixed with some new new ideas, but it's all um, generated to uh, make the uh, experience for the customer a good experience when they come in. Well, it makes me feel proud that uh, that we were able to, to get this far and I, I just can't wait to get back and, uh, and give them some service like, like they deserve, you know. Gail tells me she hopes to have the restaurant open by the middle of December. Reporting in Poland for your hometown news source, I'm Tristan Clements.